Examples of animals that hibernate. Number 10. Ground squirrels. Ground squirrels are small rodents found in a variety of geographical regions. They typically hibernate for six to nine months in the wintertime, with some species hibernating even longer. During this time, they enter a deep sleep and survive off of stored fat reserves and fur that they have grown in preparation for the winter. When they emerge in spring, they must quickly find food and restart their normal activities. Ground squirrels are some of the most common hibernating animals, with some species being found in the United States, Canada, and various parts of Europe. Number 9. Geckos. Geckos are lizards that are known for their ability to hibernate during colder months. They are small in size, usually ranging from 2 to 4 inches, and can be found in a variety of colors and patterns in almost any part of the world. During hibernation, geckos will enter a state of torpor in which their bodily functions and metabolism slow down. They will lower their body temperature and slow down their respiration. This makes them less likely to be noticed and aids in their survival during the cold months. Geckos typically hibernate from late autumn to early spring, and will emerge from hibernation during the warmer months to hunt and mate. Number 8. Garter Snakes. Garter snakes are some of the most common species of snakes in North America. They are relatively small and can be found in a variety of habitats, including urban and suburban areas. During the winter, garter snakes are known to hibernate in dens that are shared with other species of snakes, toads, and even mice. During hibernation, garter snakes remain in a state of torpor, slowing their metabolism and reducing their need for food and water. This state allows them to survive the cold, harsh winter months and to emerge in the spring to begin feeding and mating. Number 7. Fat-tailed Lemurs. Fat-tailed lemurs are a species of lemur that hibernate during the dry season in the tropical forests of Madagascar. They are nocturnal animals that are active during the night and sleep during the day. They have thick fur and a plump tail which helps them to survive the cold weather. They hibernate in tree hollows, underground burrows, and other sheltered places. During hibernation, they lower their body temperature and slow down their metabolism. This helps them to conserve energy and stay alive during the cold season. As the temperatures rise in the spring, the fat-tailed lemurs will wake up and become active again. Number 6. Hummingbirds. Hummingbirds are a type of bird that hibernate in order to survive the winter season. During hibernation, the hummingbirds go into a state of torpor, where their body temperature, rate of metabolism, and heart rate all drop in order to conserve energy. During this time, the hummingbirds can survive off of the fat reserves that they have built up during the summer months. When the temperature begins to rise and food becomes more plentiful, the hummingbirds will emerge from their hibernation and become active once again. Number 5. Chipmunks. Chipmunks are small, ground-dwelling rodents that are typically found in North America, Europe, and Asia. They are a member of the squirrel family and have a wide variety of adaptations, including their ability to hibernate. As the temperatures drop in the winter months, chipmunks will search for a safe and dry location in which to curl up and sleep for the winter. During hibernation, chipmunks will enter a deep sleep in which their body temperatures and heartbeats will slow down significantly. This allows them to conserve energy and survive the cold winter months. Chipmunks will wake up periodically throughout the winter season for brief periods of time, but will typically remain in hibernation until the weather warms up. Number 4. Bumblebees. Bumblebees are a species of social insects that live in temperate climates. They hibernate in the winter months when temperatures drop and food sources become scarce. Bumblebees seek out warm, sheltered places to hibernate. These places are typically underground, such as burrows or tunnels in the soil. During this hibernation period, a bumblebee's metabolism slows down and its body temperature decreases. This allows bumblebees to save energy and maintain a safe and secure environment without expending too much energy. When temperatures rise and food sources become more available, bumblebees come out of hibernation and resume their regular activities.
Number 3. Box Turtles Box turtles are a type of land turtle found in the United States and Mexico. They are known for hibernating in the winter. During the cold winter months, box turtles will bury themselves in the ground and enter into a state of dormancy or hibernation. This helps them conserve energy and survive the cold temperatures until spring when they begin to emerge from the ground. During hibernation, their metabolic rate decreases, their heart rate slows, and they stay in a very deep sleep. Box turtles can hibernate for up to four months, depending on the climate and temperatures. Number 2. Bears. Bears are one of the most well-known animals that hibernate, especially in colder climates. During hibernation, bears will typically den in a sheltered area, such as a cave, burrow, or hollow log. In preparation for hibernation, bears will eat voraciously during the summer and fall months to build up fat stores that will provide the energy they need to survive while hibernating. During hibernation, their body temperatures and heart rates will drop significantly and they will enter a state of dormancy. Bears will typically remain in hibernation for around 4 to 7 months, depending on the climate and availability of food when they wake up in the spring. Number 1. Ladybug. Ladybugs are not a species of animal that typically hibernate. During cold months, ladybugs spend much of their time in a state of dormancy, conserving energy until temperatures become more favorable. This is known as estivation, rather than hibernation, which is an adaptation used by some animals to survive colder months. Ladybugs may form aggregations in sheltered sites such as under rocks or in cracks of logs, in order to stay warm and conserve energy. Ladybugs may also migrate to warmer climates or move to sheltered areas of homes and buildings in order to find adequate protection from the cold. In some cases, ladybugs may become inactive for a few weeks or months during the winter, but they generally do not enter a true hibernation state. Thanks for watching our latest video on animals that hibernate. We hope you found it interesting and that it sparked your curiosity about the incredible natural world around us. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of our future videos exploring even more curiosities from around the world. See you next time!